finally, after about a year of trying, January the 23rd at the Phones View Arena, Anthony Crawler will challenge Richard Averill for the WBA lightweight championship of the world. The arena where I'm fighting for a world title at is the same arena from a young lad when I was saving up my pocket money to get a ticket to go and watch some of the greats of British boxing. Is it Nazi Mohammed I saw there? Before our own Ricky and obviously Joe Calzaga, Michael Broder, and it's to sometimes I do have to pinch myself and think, this is what I dreamed about back then, this is what I got goosebumps about when I was a young amateur boxer. And um it's something that's very special to me to be put in the same bracket as them, to be fighting there for a world title. First walked into the gym at 10 years of age. Mum and dad took me. And uh, within a few months, I think I picked up a lot of things when my dad was um, a fighter, so I was a bit of a natural. And within a few months, I was having my first fight. It was only two years ago I was fighting for my career. Cold night in December. My, my career was on the line that night in an English title fight. So in two years, a lot's changed. As much as those defeats hurt me at the time, it's made me the fighter who I am today and I'm a lot better for it. I wouldn't change them. I learned lessons from them. They always say you learn more in defeat and I genuinely like believe that. I say there's there can't be many more sports where you get that kind of adrenaline and that summit when when I hang my gloves up that I know I'll miss because I'll never get that buzz of walking out the ring for a big fight. Six weeks out from the fight, so I'm in the hard stage of training. Certainly the next three weeks, four weeks will be um, very tough before we sort of start to wind it down. I'll get a few more sort of rest days. On January the 23rd, I've been in that arena, been in big nights at that arena. Good work inside from Crawler. He's winning this battle as they go toe to toe. There can be no drug, there can be no drink. There's got to be very few sports that can give you that feeling. And that's some of only people who've done that work will know. Crawler is picking him off at will here. And down he goes. And that was coming. Murray finished. Done. Crawler has broken him up. I was in a Manchester dive that night, like the whole city was talking about that atmosphere, it was a great atmosphere, but this time, all those people there, like the city was divided, it won't be the out of the city, it'll all be behind me, supporting me. Andy Crawler's a fighter, he's just a lad who'll always come to the ring on the night, 